hello friends welcome to my channel in this video I am going to show you how to use the calculator to plot the graph so if you are using the uh, Microsoft Windows operating system you can uh, you can use the calculator the built-in calculator to plot the graphs so this calculator comes with the window you don't have to install it separately so for the now let's get started the first thing you do is go to the the search menu and then type in the CALC calculator and it will show you the calculator app and select the calculator and this is the the standard view of the calculator uh, now go to the menu and choose the graphing when you choose the graphing you will see this kind of uh, plot now maximize maximize this and uh, uh, this is the windows for the graphing and uh, uh, this is the area where you will input your equation and you have different functions here we got trigonometric functions like sine cos and we got inequality, inequalities functions like uh, smaller than or greater than and the the absolute value of x we have other function also uh, like uh, log function or exponential functions we have different function so uh, let's start plotting the graph the first graph I want to plot is for the the sine x function so uh, you can plot the sine x using two ways the first way is you can use you can select the sine x from here select the sine x and uh, uh, select the x so it is sine x so hit the enter button now it will plot the graph of the sine x and the sine x graph look like this uh, the calculator uh, take the input value of x from minus infinity to the plus infinity so this graph is unlimited this, this the graph goes all the way to the minus infinity to the plus infinity so now let's choose the uh, now here uh, you can control what you wanna see in the this window you can you can control the the windows of this graph so you can put your input you can input the values like from minus 10 to the plus 10 in the x axis and uh, similarly minus 10 to the plus 10 in the y axis so now it will the, the, the graph will only show the x value from minus 10 to the plus 10 and the y values from minus 10 to plus 10 here you can choose the different units like radian degrees gradient uh, and you can choose the uh, you can choose the um, thickness of your uh, the graph you can choose the thickness of the graph line so uh, so when you want to remove this graph just uh, click in the remove equation uh, option here and it will remove the your uh, current graph and you can input the another graph another equation so let's try the cos x so you can uh, I told you you can uh, choose the uh, sin x cos x from here or you can just type in from your keyboard like sign like cos x cos bracket x bracket close and hit the enter and it will uh, plot the uh, graph for the cos x and uh, the, the cos, x, cos x graph look like this and then remove this graph and I wanna put I wanna put the graph of the 10x so type in the 10x and hit the enter you will see the graph of the 10x and the graph of 10x look like this uh, as you know the value of 10x is infinity at the 90 degree so at 90 degree this graph will go all the way to the infinity and at 180 degree it will be zero so the graph of 10x look like this let's try the the different equation let's try minus 10 uh, minus 10 divided by x square plus minus 10 divided by x square plus 5 divided by x to the power 9 
so this is a little complex graph and uh, the graph look like this uh, when the x value is uh, negative the graph will look like this and when the value of x is positive the graph will look like this so when you when you want to put the uh, x group x to the power something just type in the x and uh, press the shift plus six key six numerical key the up, up arrow keys from the keyboard then it will put the power uh, let's remove this equation and I will I want to I will show you how to put the multiple uh, equation at the same time so we can plot the multiple graph at the same time so let's try this I want to put the log X and hit the enter and here you will see the the option to input the another equation so let's put a, a exponential e to the power x here and uh, let put the x to the power square here so i i put the three equation and uh, it plot the three equation at the same time so you see the every equation have different color so the log x is a blue color uh, exponential is green color and the x square is a red color so you will see a different color equation here so this is the blue color is for the log x this red color is for the x square and the green color is for the e to the power x so you can put the multiple graph like this you can add you can add another graph also uh, you can like you can add many graph as many as you want so <clears throat> Uh, when you, uh, if you wanna copy this graph, just right click on your uh, in the graphing area. Just right click and copy, and uh, you can paste into the word or other wherever you want. So it will just uh, copy the graph from the calculator, and uh, you can use it in your different project or different uh, presentation anywhere you want. Uh, you can remove this equation. <clears throat> or you can you can hide you can hide equation also so I have two equation if you if you click on this this uh, this equation you it will hide and if you again click here it will show if you click here it will hide if you again click here it will show the equation so it, in this way you can uh, choose whichever equation you want to see or which one you don't want to see uh, that's all for today thank you for watching this video uh, please subscribe my channel uh, i will see you in next video till then bye